And hello my Gemini, it is Tori, the Hope Dealer of Guided Intuition and I am here to do your monthly spiritual guidance from Spirit, your guides, Jesus, Allah, the universe, honey, whatever it is you believe in, okay? This is what they want you to pay attention to in the month of March. Okay, my Gemini, we are going to go ahead and get started and jump right into your reading, honey. I know that I usually have um, this whole thing that I say, if you are new to my channel, welcome. Make sure that you like, comment, subscribe, honey. Um, I usually have this thing that I say in the beginning, but I want to go ahead and really get into Gemini's reading, but also understand that that um, this is a general reading, so it may resonate with some and may not with others. So, others but do not worry there are so many sweet souls that are sharing their gifts you are going to find someone that picks up on your energy i preferably love rainbow harmony <laughs> who is amazing she does more pick a card readings honey but you will get your fix and what you need but if you do vibe with me and like my energy you can check out um all of my information on how to contact me and schedule a personal reading in the description box below so gemini I honestly want to let you know that in the month of March, okay, it is very important that you see the beauty that is your life, okay? Because I know certain things and certain situations can happen and we can get in those moments and we're like, oh my God, you know, we get in a funk, okay? Those things happen. However, it's all about where you are placing your energy, all about what are you looking at? Because I feel like for everybody, but especially you, okay, this is a transformational time, Gemini, okay? It really is. So just keep that in mind, you know? So how I do my monthly spiritual guidance, my love muffins, if you're new to my channel, it's right here. It's going to be the things that you're going to be thinking about are the things that spirit are going to be placing on your heart and in your mind. All right, Gemini, over here is everything that you need to know about love for this month. Right here is a major thing that's going to be happening, a major shift for Gemini. Anything that spirit feels like if you apply or you know will bring you more fulfillment this month, then here are the words that spirit wants Gemini to keep at the forefront of their mind. And I added something new, okay? I went ahead and picked some cards concerning any obstacles that may come up this month and how you can really overcome these obstacles that you may face, okay? Any obstacles that come up during the month, because let's face it, we do have them, but this is the way that you can really um, come overcome those obstacles. And the first card that I drew as far as you overcoming obstacles this month, um, Gemini, is with the six of air, which deals with clarity. So you choosing to go above the situation, all right? Cho choosing to see the beauty in every situation that occurs in your life. Finding clarity in everything to help you move forward is really going to help you overcome these obstacles, okay? And also we have the eight of air interference. I feel like sometimes you can get in your own way. And that is just because... Gemini, I feel like you hold yourself to such a standard, okay? You just don't allow yourself to be at times. And just understand that you are go undergoing a great transformation in your life. So allow yourself that grace. Allow yourself, you know, a time. You're allowed to have some moments. You're allowed to be. But I want you to find the beauty in your life, okay? All right? Find the beauty in your life, Gemini, and, and don't be afraid. Like if, if things get mixed up, it'll work itself out, okay? <laughs> it really, really um, will. And just remember to breathe, okay? Just remember to breathe because I really feel like there's a new beginning. There's a new awakening that's going to be happening in you in the month of March. And it all starts with you seeing the beauty in your life. And I really feel like you're going to be coming into that energy, okay? So that's how you're going to overcome any obstacles that may come your way in the month of March. Now, let's see what is crowning my love muffins this month. So as far as what is crowning you, um, a lot of you are definitely on a health change, health care change. I feel like this is you making a decision to um, maybe even go back to a way of a lifestyle or a way of being that really helped you, okay? Because I feel like for some of you, Gemini... Well, just how that candle fell over. <laughs> All right, Gemini, I truly feel like there is some kind of healthcare change that you're going to be making for yourself to go back to or start that is really going to give you the energy, all right, or give you, you know, 
the insight to really see that your life is beautiful. Just You're just going to gain your confidence back, okay? You're, this is really going to put you back on track. So anything that you do as far as healthcare change, all right, within your body, maybe you're worried about something within your body, anything that you do to better yourself, eating healthier, ex exercising, I don't know, maybe sex, I don't know. <laughs> Any of those things are really going to help you um, really gain the confidence or really see the beauty that is in your life, okay? Also, I feel like there are going to be some major decisions that you're going to be making. A lot of you, it is it is in healthcare. It's something to do with your health. I do see some decisions that you're going to be making. I also feel like um, just in life in general, it's really going to help you, okay? There's some important decisions that's going to be crowning you. So remember how to overcome these decisions. Maybe you're stuck in a place. Remember how to overcome any off obstacle that you may foresee in the month of... um in the month of March, just go back to that and, and look at it, okay? Also, you're being guided to volunteer, come out of your comfort zone. You're, it's time for you to really get back to you and get back in your, um, get back involved in your life. <laughs> I feel like you've probably been in hermit mode um, for some, some while about a situation or something, but spirit wants you to know that you are stronger than you know, okay, Gemini? It's time for you to get back out. I feel like it could have been financial issues, a lot of different things for all of us, but finances are coming through. I feel like definitely with love, I definitely feel like some kind of health health kick scare or, you know, just not feeling confident about your body and the way that you're looking. But I feel like those are just some of the things that I'm really feeling strongly. But Spirit is saying it's time for you to come out. It's time for you to come back into your life and realize there's so much to be happy for. There's so much beauty in your life. And um, you are stronger than you know. And if you have already realized that, I am so utterly happy for you, okay? <laughs> now, let's go and see. We're going to see. We're going to do love. Yeah, went over here first. We're going to do love, okay? So when it comes to love, all right? I feel like we have the honeymoon, so I feel like you could definitely be meeting somebody if you haven't already met them, but it's still more in that earlier stage, okay? I feel like it's safe for you to really love this person. It's safe for you to open up. However, the passion is reversed, okay? Um, I feel like it's more so on your end, okay? But for some of you, it could be their end, but I feel like um, nine times out of ten, it's on you, Gemini. You're just not really focused on that. You know, you're just not really vibing with that person. I feel like you're kind of, you know, tired of getting the same thing when it comes to relationships. So you're probably like sticking in with yourself. Okay. But you are being noticed that this could be the one there could be a potential, you know, with, um, for love with this person right here, we have the king of cups. All right. So I feel like they're definitely someone that you can vibe with, someone that has stability. And maybe that's why you're a little nervous of them, because I know that, you know, some of you are definitely gaining stability. OK, um, and I, I feel like but you're kind of like closed off. You're in imprint right now. You're really reser reserving your energy that you have for yourself. OK, but this does have the makings to be. We have the lovers. So it is some kind of connection. It is some kind of passion. They are attracted to you, even though you're feeling like they're not. I feel like if you feel like they're not attracted to you, um, it's simply because you're not at your highest right now. It's as far as your confidence. But you are being guided to stay optimistic about your love life, because whether you move on with this person or not, um, I feel like your love life is definitely going to be coming, um, is going to be moving forward with the chariot, okay? And I feel like you're going to be doing the necessary things to cut away and really enjoy and be present in your um, relationships or just really present in when it comes to the subject of love. But I feel like you're cutting away. Yeah, my solar plex is hurting, honey. You are really gaining some confidence back in that area. I feel like that you lost. But we have the Wheel of Fortune and it's turning in your favor. So keep going, okay? <laughs> keep going, Gemini. Now, when it comes to um, something major that's going to be happening to Gemini in the month of March, okay? Something major that I have for you guys. The first thing I have is observe, okay? So it's very important that you look at things for what they are, Gemini, okay? That you pull back and you look at all four corners, all, um, all sides of a story. Look at it from your point of view, their point of view, and then we know it's your point of view, their point, point of view, and then the truth, okay? So you definitely want to make sure that you're looking and observing everything before you d detach yourself away from a situation, Okay? Or even maybe it's time for you to, for some of you, I feel like you you could meet, you could go hasty and jump the guns, 
But if you are looking at it and you're just clearly seeing that something is not right, okay, in any situation that you get into, you're being guided to speak your truth, okay? And I feel like this is going to bring the healing that you desire. Some situation that um, I feel like you're detached from and spirit is just wanting you to, you know, to look at it, you know, and speak your truth because I feel like in the midst of you speaking your truth, this is when healing can occur, okay? Now, as far as what you need to know that can bring you more fulfillment this month is we have specialness. And like I said, you just have to come and realize that you are amazing, all right? That you are truly amazing, Gemini. And, um, you know, I know sometimes we can get in those moments, you know, where <laughs> we don't feel amazing, but I feel like that's going to be ending for you with a death card here. I am learning that endings are merely beginnings. Maybe you've lost something or someone or something that is very dear and special to you, and it's kind of hard for you to, you know, go on. It's kind of hard for you, but you just have to find the beauty. Understand with every ending, there's a new beginning coming, okay? Now, as far as the words that spirit wants you to keep at the forefront of your mind, honey, <laughs> the first one we have is vulnerability. I need you to be vulnerable, especially in this love situation too. I feel like you're just closed off right now, but you're being guided in every situation, be vulnerable. And this is what it's going to take for you, Gemini, to really um, use your throat chakra and speak your truth truth is to be vulnerable all right and spirit is going to be giving you a lot of signs and wonders things are going to start making six making sense and coming together okay and it first starts with you seeing the beauty in your life all right my babies so i love you so much my gemini's it was such an honor to read for you guys as always i'm sending you so much love so much light and so much peace go out and have an amazing march Okay, and don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share. Thank you for all your love, comments. I love to um, talk to you guys, and I will catch you on my channel. Take care.